Hello everyone, I am GameOP Connoisseur, and once again I thank you for 100 subscribers. This is the 100 subscriber question and answer. I have received questions from many people, mostly friends, uh, throughout Skype and online, and I believe I have about 13 comments. I don't know how many questions there are. I don't know if you used all three questions. Nonetheless, I'm here to answer them to the best of my ability without hesitating or thinking for too long. And I, once again, thank you. And I'm here to answer questions that you've asked about me. I don't know why you'd ask some of them, but you asked whatever you're about to ask me. So here we go. Um, pardon me for this weird layout. I'm just testing things and I'm trying things out. Um, so sorry. But uh, anyway, um, let me take a look. Grandmaster Flair asks, what is your favorite episode? Well, while I don't have a favorite episode at the moment because I don't want to reserve judgment for when the series is over, one of, one of the episodes I like the most, or at least some, would have to be um, Castle Sweet Castle because I like the metaphor with the tree. I always liked imagery and metaphors. Um, what else can I relate to that I like? Um, season four, um, season five premiere um, was nice. Um, so was the season four finale, as most people like. I mean, it was a bit, it was a bit too like you know. I'm not gonna say the violence wasn't a bad thing, but it's straight off of the, it's it, fighting is not really, what the show, tries to like, teach you. And I know it's telling you not to fight and all, but the fighting scene just led to like the moral and the lesson and everything. Not that it would have been better without it, but it could have been the same without it. Um, you also ask, what is my least favorite episode? I didn't care for Spike at your service, um, particularly because of the fact that sometimes friends just do things for friends because you're friends and that's just what you do. And while that was sort of the moral, I just didn't like how they went about it, and overall, I disapprove of Spike not really doing a good thing, and consistently doing that good thing, and not overdoing it, or not doing it, uh, just getting into trouble. I do agree that that isn't the best thing. Also, what is the character you relate to the most? I've always felt that at different times in the day, month, or just in my life, I've related to the main six in many ways. Um, I definitely have an honest synth. I definitely have an honest side like Applejack, and I'm extremely shy. I get stage fright. Um, while I'm not like fast or or athletic like Rainbow Dash, I I sometimes just relate to her in certain ways. Um, definitely smart and knowledgeable and philosophical like Twilight. Uh, I guess I don't really relate to priority. I mean, I guess generosity. I do give a lot of my time to people and help them. Uh, and Pinkie Pie, a lot of people can just relate. Like, you know, I'm just a, I can definitely be a fun person, at least online, uh, when I'm playing games. Um, let's move on to the next one. Star Screamer 65 says, "What is your confirmation episode?" And that means the episode of My Little Pony, French vs. Magic, that solidified your opinion for the show. I stated this before, or at least I thought I did. I actually, I'm um, purposely watched the show from its series premiere because when I was young, I remember G3, and even though I was in middle school, this just attracted me, and I wanted to see how much it, 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 it had improved, even though it was a girl show, and normally you would have probably just overlooked it. I actually got hooked to it before it even premiered. So I guess I would say the series premiere I really liked, because um, it got me hooked to today and beyond. So yeah, um, Sky, Sky Prowl Bite asks, how would you order your most to least favorite of the main six and why? That will probably be in a future video, but off the top of my head, and this might, if not, it will change, my favorite would probably either be Twilight, or... Hmm. It would either be Twilight, 
maybe you were Pinkie Pie. Um, I can't really explain the reasons why, but I can definitely think of it for, for the future episode. After that, it would be a tie between Applejack and Fluttershy, and then Rarity. Rarity probably wouldn't be my most favorite. Rainbow Dash would be somewhere in the mix as well. Have you ever met any MLP voice actors? No. Um, I love to go to BronyCon, but they moved it back a month, which means that there's no way it can go now. I was expecting being a lifeguard this year, getting paid for at least the first month, if not the second, and then going to the convention, and then I heard that they moved, got moved back a month. So there's no chance of me doing that. So, no, I haven't met any, and chances are I won't for at least another two years. What's your most anticipated episode for the rest of the season? Um, off of the next three synopsises, I'm going to definitely look... I'm definitely looking forward to the one where Rainbow Dash is accused of a crime because this, because I'm interested in the legalities of Equestria. So, I'm definitely into that. Uh, scriptless... Oh, no, skip one. Nigh Tide Eye asks, Who do you find prettier, Fallen or Sapphire? For those of you who don't know, those are two reviewer slash analysts in the community. Um, I'm going to reserve judgment for, for that question and plead the fifth, as I know that, that it will be the smartest move, because if either of them are going to watch this video, then they will probably literally figuratively mentally kill me, so I plead the fifth on that. Um, Scriptless asks, why does your Pony OC have a monocle? Because connoisseurs have monocles. I mean, what more do you want? Like, I guess Ratatouille, you know, the guy, the critic, has a monocle, I think. I don't know, connoisseurs have monocles. It makes me look professional. Uh, Manga, Kamen, Manga Common asks, What other fandoms do you consider yourself a part of? None. I am solely a brony and will never, ever be a traitor to this fandom. Unless they bring back G3.5. Uh, Drummer Shy asks, Will you ever go to a pony convention like Brony Connor Babscon? God willing, God willing with Celestia's help, yes, as I stated before. You know, Roni asks, if you were to redesign your C, what would be the number one thing you would change for the redesign? Um, I'm going to answer that later because I already see a question coming up, and this will answer that question. What do you consider as a short-term goal for your channel? Um, I have no subscriber goal or viewer goal. I just hope that I become known enough that I can either talk and be known throughout the community and or just influence other people to be a part of the community. Um, overall, that's what I try and do. What episode do you f do you foresee yourself reviewing in the near future? Uh, I hope to review the 14th episode when it comes out, at least in my webcam, because I don't have my OC vectored, but I would definitely love to at least review it, like like I did with Sky with the Skyla video I did. Um, Next question from Miss Anthropony: Can you do a handstand while balancing eggs on your feet? I'll take that challenge another time. Let's put it that way. I will actually open up a sticky notes right now. I know you can't see it. You know, you know. No, hold on. Okay, sticky notes. I'm gonna write this now. I'm, I'm gonna copy and paste this. Can you do a handstand on your feet? Copy. I'm going to paste it there. I'll keep it in mind. Okay. Okay, uh, next question from Moon Solis. Pony should pony pony, yes. Pony should pony pony. I don't know if that's sexual, but, you know, yes. All your ships will come true. Uh, next question from Mariba Kuman. What's the question? Um, here, let me help you with that. Uh... Google, what is a question? I'm dumb for not knowing this answer myself. Uh, come on, computer, you can do this. Don't fail me now. There you go. Okay, question. A sentence worded or expressed as... A sentence worded or expressed so as to elicit information or as a verb asking questions of, in parentheses, someone, especially in an official context. I know you didn't see that, but um, that's what it said. Take my word for it. Last question from the Secret Dreamer. Why eyelashes? Why eyelashes? Um, those two questions are the same, first off. And secondly, this is to answer Unova's question. Um, long story short, for a year, I didn't notice I put eyelashes in the General Zoya OC. The end. I fixed it, by the way. Um, so later videos, that won't be there.
No, I'm not gay or or bisexual or transgender in any way. That was a total animation error. Huge animation error. And finally, if senpai could senpai senpai, how much senpai could senpai senpai? This is just like pony shit pony pony. Are you two freaking coming up with these questions together? Um, I don't approve of the term senpai in the internet memes terms. I approve of the word senpai in its actual term and used appropriately and not every second like, oh, my best friend is my senpai. So, no is the answer to this question. And that was my 100 subscriber question and answer. And this was the video. It got 40 views and it got 13 questions. Um, well, 13 comments. I don't know. Let me count. 3, 3, 7, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 17, 18, 19, 20. It got 23 questions. So, good. I'm, I'm very happy about that. Um, anyway, um, I'll, you know, I'm going to ask myself a question. Um...